Dear Mammy, would you give it a go again? Just for old time's sake? Weightlifting? You must be joking with my bad knees. Ah, uh, go on, Mammy. I bet you still have it in you. Yeah, Mammy. I'd love to see you lift a big heavy thing. Ah, uh, will you stop? You're only embarrassing me now. The lamprey uses its suction cup mouth to move rocks and expose the pebbles that will protect its 200,000 eggs. Although, it does look like fun. Maybe I could give it one go. That's the spirit, Mammy. I'll do a few stretches first to get warmed up. I don't know. My legs aren't what they used to be. <gasps> Mammy, I've just remembered what you're missing. Your lucky headband. Daddy, you kept it all these years. Bring me my weights. Weights? I never thought of that. Uh... Only about 1% of these eggs will survive and hatch into lampreys. Many of the eggs will become food for other animals. That's tea sorted then. Eggs on toast, slimy lamprey caviar, a meal fit for a king. Daddy, no! We don't want to eat lamprey. Please don't make us eat it, Daddy. Frankie, if you make them sick again, you're cleaning it up, OK? I'm only joking, cubs. We're not having lamprey for tea. We're having the same thing we eat every night. Deep fried rat burgers! <laughs> Good one, Frankie. Once they have laid their eggs, the lamprey parents will die shortly afterwards. <sighs> ah, yeah, the circle of life. Lampreys provide an important source of food for river animals such as otters and herons. Grandad, I wonder what ever happened to old Gilly? I was probably eaten by a heron. Oh, <laughs> circle of life, I guess. Historically, lampreys were also considered a delicacy by some humans. And Julius Caesar and Henry I were both reported to have enjoyed eating lamprey at their banquets. 1, 11, 54, 89, Go on, Mammy. I knew you could do it. Just like the good old days, Mammy. You never lost it. So let's recap on what we learned about the sea lamprey. It has a fearsome-looking suction cup mouth with up to 12 rows of teeth. It feeds by sucking blood and is known as the vampire fish. It uses its mouth to move large rocks when it's building its nest. It has been around since before the dinosaurs. And it can regenerate parts of its body if it gets injured. 